to my channel. I know it's been a hot minute. If you are new here, thank you so much for joining. I hope you decide to stay. Um, this week I am going to be planning in the weekly view in my 2023 Hobonichi Cousin. Um, I have already planned a couple of weeks, so here is a look at the last couple of weeks, or the first two weeks, I should say, of the year. I did not plan the week that had all of December and January 1st on it, just because that was in my other planner and the majority of that week was in 2022. So I just went ahead and started with January 2nd. Um, I have shown you guys my monthly already. Um, I did add a couple of things and rescheduled some things, but my monthly stays pretty empty. I just you really use it for important things in the future and I haven't done February yet and then I was going to give you an update on my fitness tracker which I am doing in the yearly overview as you can see um, I didn't start off very well but we were on vacation and then I was just exhausted when we got home but I have been fairly consistent now today is the 21st and I haven't worked out since the 16th um, haven't been feeling good. My husband is actually, um, positive for the C word. Um, I am not and no one else is, but I've just been, I've had a back, some back pains. I think I like pulled a muscle or something. So I've just been resting. I actually think I might work out later today. So, but yeah. Um, also, I ordered a new bike seat and pedals for my Peloton because all of these yellows are walking. I haven't cycled in a while. Um, I gave the bike seat a good several weeks try, but you guys, <laughs> my butt couldn't handle that seat. So I got a, I ordered a bigger butt cushioned seat, which I'm excited about. So <laughs> anyways. Let's go ahead and plan. This week I have a kit from my friend Anita. I bought it from her Etsy shop. If you're interested, I will link her shop below. It's just a cute two-page kit with pinks, blues, and kind of like a tealish green color. The designs are Christmas bulbs, so this was meant more for a holiday kit, but that's okay. I'm going to use it anyways, and we might just not use those or cover them up. I love the little flower petals and the color scheme. I did play a little bit with washi before I started recording. I don't have like a ton of washi. I think I'm actually going to go with this one from the Coffee Monsters Co. It has some yellow in it, but I really like the pastels and how they go with the kit. So let me find that washi. I don't know where I put it. Here it is. I'm not a fan of the Simply Gilded. Um, the two colors that I pulled out, I don't have much washi, but they're not the right colors for this kit. So I'm not gonna use that. I kind of liked the Shine Sticker Studio washi, but I already have this rainbow washi from the Coffee Monsters Co. Um, I do think I'm going to use this Sleepy washi from the Coffee Monsters Co. It's not an exact match, but this week I was tired and slept a lot, so I think it's actually perfect. And I do still need to color match my Tombos. As you guys know, if you've watched me before, I do always designate this very back page in my planner for like watch washi um, extra bits and scraps. So I am actually some of this washi that I tested. I'm just gonna stick it on this page. 
because I want to use the sticky note, like the spaces that I'm from the washi I'm not using in order to swatch my Tombows. And then, oh, I do want this. I'll just take one of these and move it over here. And I'll stick this guy here. Maybe we'll save this for a daily page or something just to stick the whole sticky note on there with a quote or something. So I'm just gonna set that aside. And then I will swatch some Tombos on this in hopes to get a good color match or two. This is my little, my handy little, little notebook that I swatched my Tombos in. While I realize the paper is different, it's pretty close. I have thought about doing like a swatch in one of the note pages in the back of my planner with my Tombos. I may actually do that, but I do still like the process of doing the washi um, and the Tombow swatches on the sticky note, so we'll see. All right, so because the washi pulls out a yellow color, I am going to match a yellow, and I think the kit doesn't have the yellow, but the washi does, and I think I like this one, so this is 90. So I'm going to take that. Um, the pink, I really like how it matches up with this washi, so we just need to find a pink to go with. Hmm, we might not have one. I think 703 is probably the closest that I have. Yeah, because those are kind of the wrong shades. 703 is the right type of shade. It's just darker. Oh man, you guys, this is hard. We might not do a pink. Let's try the blue. Or maybe we could just match it to the washi. Maybe I'll just do the 800, which is a super subtle pink. Um, it'd be great for kind of coloring in my own boxes to write over. So let's do that. This green, I absolutely love. I don't know that I have a marker that color. I am, I don't have the entire Tombow collection. I have a bunch of them. I don't have the entire, I think I'm missing about 10 colors. And where these spaces are is where I'm missing. So it could very well be that the colors I'm missing are <laughs> maybe the best match for the green. I think, this is so hard. Let's go with 291. It's more of a bluish, but I think it's probably the best match out of what I have. Who knows? I might not use it. I might hate the swatch. And the blue. Golly, you guys, the colors in this kit are very unique. And I just don't have matches. Well, if we match the washi, I think 451. No. This is so hard. Let's just not have one. Let's go with this. So 
So my colors are, let's see, 90 for anyone watching, wanting to try to match themselves if you pick up this kit. Again, this kit is from Anita Budgets. She is on Etsy and um, I will link her shop below. Let's see, 800. All right, so this is what I'm doing for a swatch with this. I think it'll work out. It all looks great together. So I'm just gonna set my sticky note aside. And put my swatch book away. Hopefully you guys, I'm also gonna be able to do a reel today um, for my book log. I have a couple of books in there. Um, or I have a couple of books under my belt that I need to add to my book log and add my little review. I'm excited because one of the books I'm adding is my is was such a good book and I highly recommend it to everyone. So if you are if you follow on my Instagram, stay tuned for that. Um, okay, let's get started. So date covers is where I want to start. Um, so yeah, this last week has kind of been unproductive. I worked on, so trying to quarantine from my husband and, um, so I don't get sick, which has worked, but it's also been hard. And it's also been hard in that I'm having to pick up slack for a lot of things that like my husband helps with that he really shouldn't be doing like um for example just today um grocery pickup and delivery we not only picked up groceries but we already has we also had some delivered and I had to put it lug it all in and put it all away he usually helps with like the heavy stuff that goes out in the garage fridge, but I had to do everything just because we don't want him touching everything. And yeah, so let's see. I think I want to use one of these just plain. Oh, maybe this week. Let's use the this week. And oh, good. She has some, um, dots in her kit too so I'll be able to make a list let me grab my tweezers here and I want to start with pink Okay, now I'm gonna use this blank one um, just because I like to put my menu in the sidebar and I will write in menu and oops, I took one too many of the dots, but you know what? I think I'm gonna use the flags. Let's use the flags for the menu. So, and we don't want to start with blue. Let's start with green. Okay, there we go. Perfect. So I did seven of them, one for each day of the week for our menu this week. And let's put some washi down. So I chose both of these washies. I'm actually gonna put the sleepy time washi at the top. I pretty much slept in every day this week, which was nice. Of course, sleeping in for me is seven o'clock. I think there might have been actually today I slept in until, well, I was going to say I slept until eight. I didn't actually sleep until eight. I just like remained in bed 
until that time. I think I was actually like awake though by seven. But again, that is sleeping in for me. There we go. And grab my good old Panera gift card. <laughs> and I don't know that I don't think I'm going to use this again. So I'll probably put that away. And then I'm going to take this scrap and stick it in the back. Perfect. So next, I'm going to add this rainbow washi that I picked out to the bottom. I really love this washi. And just so I don't cover that flag in the menu, I'm going to do it further down than I normally do, which is okay. We'll have to see if I can find some deco to fill in, which is what I usually do during the hours when I'm sleeping, because <laughs> I really don't have anything to plan, you know, down in this section here. And this kit doesn't have deco. It has some nice boxes, tons of boxes, which I love but no deco. So I may have to dig through my sticker book to see what I can find. And then I'll put this scrap in the back right there. All right. So I work 10 to seven all week. Um, even though I wasn't feeling the best and my back was hurting. Um, like I said, I think I pulled something. I did go ahead and work all week. Um, and I turned out fine. I think, what color should I use? I think I'll use, there's no yellow in the actual like kit sticker. So I think I'm going to use yellow for my work. I work 10 to 7 every day. So I'm just going to mark that now. And when I say every day, I mean Monday through Friday. Every day that I work. And then up at the top, I just like to letter the word work. There we go. Okay, so on Monday I worked. Um, in the morning I actually designed contact cards. And I'm going to use this cute um, pen sticker. I think this is from the Style Planner. And I am going to use this super light pink that I talked about being a great background for writing over. And um, I will fill that in as soon as it um, dries a little bit. Another thing I did, and I will use a box. Let's do some green. Um, I brainstormed ideas for new contact cards, which have been released. And I really, I like this cat sticker. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it looks like it's closing its eyes and thinking really hard. That or it's taking a poo. I'm not sure, or maybe it's a headache sticker. I'm not sure, but it made me think like, ooh, the cat's thinking really hard. So, um, brainstorm. And then up here, all right, I didn't have much else going on um, this week, or this day, excuse me. 
on Tuesday, I worked on listing images and I found this computer sticker. I'm trying to remember. I think it was like Renita plans. I can't even remember the store I got this from. I think she changed her name to something of long like cats or something. But yeah, so um, listing images. I worked on those. Um, I worked from 10 to 7. I did have a team meeting. Let me grab a sticker here. I kind of pre-picked out some stickers, you guys. Um, this was with Team Kate. So I join in on other team meetings kind of to help moderate and go over issues that we're having at work or provide education. Um, and so I end up having, I join two of those per week and then I have my own team meeting um, with the team of other leads in the company. And then, oh, I wanted to mark some, this is the day my husband tested positive. Let's pick a pink label and I'm going to put it down here. Although he tested positive, I think earlier in the day, I think it was actually in the morning, but we'll just stick it down there. And I did grab this a Modi sticker. Um, not much else that went on. Let's see. On Wednesday. Oh, I should mark my back pain. I think it was Wednesday that I started having back pain. Um, yes. And I did not grab a sticker for that. So let's see if we can find one. I'm pretty sure we have something that will work from Cupcakes and Stickies. Actually, I have piles of stickers everywhere, you guys. And I saved one of the contact cards that Desiree, here we go. So Desiree Plans is like one of my best planner friends and she ordered contact cards. Um, I actually created them and made them and created listing images and everything based on her contact cards. Um, and there were a couple that were oopsies. I don't know why this one's oops. Oh, it's just really, it's cut off center. Um, but I saved a couple of the ones that were oopsies because I knew I would use the stickers. And this one with Loretta crying um, will be a good sticker to mark my back pain. It was all day Wednesday and then a little bit on Thursday and then it went away. So I think I'll use, let's see, let's do green and I'll do it up here because it was in the morning. And I'll just write that in. Okay. Um, I did, I was able to manage to work. I just had to get up and move around a lot and stretch and whatnot. I did get happy mail this day. Um, let's see. I think I will use the 
And now let's do let's do the teal down here because I have a pink sticker there. So I'm just gonna do some teal there, and then I have this package sticker from I think Paper Bits Co. If I'm wrong and I have the wrong shop, I'm apologize. And then I did have a meeting, another team meeting. Um, and that was actually right when I started at 10, but that's okay. And this was Team Read. Okay. Um, this These are pa both Paper Bits Co. I like the little bear with the glasses. So, yeah. And then down here, um, my Peloton. Um, I think it pedal converters is what I'm going to call. I have not installed them yet. I think I'm actually going to go down after I make this video and install them and do a ride. So I ordered not only a bigger, cushier bike seat, but I also got these pedal converters so that you can wear your regular shoes. Um, like they're strappy and put your regular shoes in them and then like tighten these straps around your shoes so your feet stay on the pedals and they're more, I don't know, so they're not flying everywhere. <laughs> um, not only that, but then my kids can use it without special shoes. The shoes that came free with my Peloton bike are way too tight on me. And I think maybe that's why they're offering them for free. And people are saying that these shoes are being found in TJ Maxx for super cheap right now. Um, let's see. Oh, you guys, I forgot to put the dates. Let's see. I'm going to use my Unipin pen for the dates. Actually, no, I want a brush pen because I like the way it looks. Um, Fudensuki, Fudasoka, Fudensuki. I'm not sure. Fudensuki, Tombow Fudensuki. This is the hard tip one. I'm going to just use two right in the dates. There we go. Doesn't have to be anything fancy. Sometimes, most of the time, I just don't want to bother with those tiny little day stickers, so I just write them in. Um, okay, so Thursday, the 19th, so I worked. Oh, I had my lead team meeting. And of course, I didn't get, I don't think I grabbed a sticker for that. I might have to find one. Um, let's see. Here we go. We'll use this Zoom sticker. We actually use WebEx at work, but the Zoom sticker works. And that is closer to the middle of my shift. Um, let's see. So I did print and cut Desiree's cards and I, I grabbed a little portrait. Let me also, I'm going to grab a box. I like this big pink one. There we go. Okay. And oh. I posted on my Instagram stories about the contact cards. Oh. 
also, <laughs> let's see. I think, I think that was it for this day. Now, Friday, I have a lot going on. So I did do an IG post and I have this, um, text or script sticker from randy.plans. It's really old. I don't know if she has these anymore. Um, but the Go Wild contact cards were released on Friday. And so I posted on Instagram. Um, I also, what a day, you guys, what a day. I, I'm, I, I was, I'm so mad. Let me get a box. Um, I think I want a green box. You'll never believe what I did, you guys. I spilled, I knocked my coffee cup over, which has a lid, but it still has like the little hole to drink from. Um, I spilled it on my stickered book. This book here that you guys have seen, but, and it, it was mostly on the cover, but it got like, it ruined a bunch of stickers. So man, so yeah, I wanted this mad face. Um, what else? So this is the 20th. I posted IG. I spilled my coffee. I, let's see. I cut more stickers. And I think I just want to use like this blue flag for that. And then I will grab a silhouette sticker, which I'm pretty sure I have them in the front. Any of the stickers you see in this book are available in my shop, cupcakesandstickies.com. We are on Etsy. So how am I gonna do this? Do I want to do it like that? Like that? I don't know. Um, we'll just kind of do it sideways like that. And um, print and cut stickers. I was still printing and cutting Desiree's stickers at this point um, because she ordered a lot, like a lot. Everyone at Go Wild is probably going to get one of her contact cards. Everyone that comes across her anyways. Let's see. Got the spilled coffee. Okay, that was pretty much it um, on Saturday. It was Loretta's birthday. And you guys, actually, I have these cupcake stickers and I wanted those because we actually went and got cupcakes for Loretta. We ended up going to Oh My Cupcakes. I don't know if they're like everywhere, but a dozen cupcakes later and like almost $60. <laughs> there we go. Um, Loretta turned 23. Um, that would have been yesterday. I'm filming on Sunday the 22nd. Hopefully I can get this posted today, but if not, it might be the 23rd. 
Um, but yeah, Loretta turned 23 on January 21st. Um, what else? Oh, I weighed in and I have this, I believe this is the style planner. You guys, I lost two pounds this week. And then, oh, I watered my plants. Um, they were all being super droopy. Now it didn't take me this long to water all my plants. They're all in my office, but they were being super like a droopy and my bamboo, actually the leaves were turning crispy. I feel like I watered them last week. I usually only water my plants um, once a week because they're the type of plants that don't really need a lot of attention, but maybe I forgot. <laughs> Who knows? Um, let's see. Oh, for supper. That's right. I was going to grab a sticker out ahead of my video, but I forgot. We had Buffalo Wild Wings. We were going to go to, like the plan was to go to Red Lobster on Friday night, but because my husband um, is sick, we had to postpone. We're still going to take Loretta to Red Lobster at some point in time. Um, it'll just be in the future. And she was okay with that. She understood. Let's see. I feel like there was like a wing basket in here. This one might do. It might actually kind of looks like a hot dog and fries, but. Yeah, it looks like a hot dog and fries, but we're going to go with it because it's hard to tell. Right. Some of these stickers, um, yeah, see that one kind of came off. They're just not sticking to the sheets anymore. I ordered from a Happy Daya like blowout sale and I'm almost wondering if the stickers were like super old in her like inventory because they don't they don't like stick so this one isn't going to probably stick very well which is okay I might actually put some tape on it so um <laughs> we actually went to pick up the buffalo wild wings it's down it's like a mile away and it's mostly highway because we live kind of out of town the buffalo wild wings is on the edge of town and then we're we live out of town near that edge of town, so it's not a big deal to pick up. Um, I mean, we saved money from delivery, but it was such a mess. So you guys, I don't know how much I've told on social media or whatnot, but we had a massive so snowstorm followed by another snowstorm, followed by even more snow, like, the side, like if you walk down my sidewalk, the snow comes up to probably my chest. It's just so deep. And the parking lots and businesses everywhere are having problems. <laughs> so we went and we couldn't even find, we couldn't find a spot to park, to even go in and pick up the food. So I dropped her off at the door and then I had to go three businesses down to even park. Um, because all the parking lots are messes. You can't see lines or anything because, I mean, the ground is white everywhere. The snow is so high. They don't have anywhere to put it. So they do put it in parking spots. And yeah, it's, it was just a disaster, but it worked out. Um, I'm trying to find my tape, but we may have to try... We might have to cross our fingers. 
and hope it sticks. Aha, I found it. So I'm just going to, because these Happy Dia older stickers, there we go. I just put some of this Tombow sticky tape on it to make sure it sticks. Let's put that down here. So yeah, um, and then this is today. Again, I'm recording on Sunday, January 22nd. Lots happened so far today, so um, Loretta is sick. She is not doing well. Um, we don't know if maybe some of the food was bad. I don't think so. No one else in the house is feeling bad. She might have like a stomach bug or could be, um, gallbladder. It, it kind of sounds like it, but you never know. Um, so I'm just going to mark that. Um, so that was the first thing, um, this morning. And then I started laundry laundry the never ending chore so we will mark that with i have this fox and pip laundry sticker um so i started laundry and then my husband and i left to pick up groceries <laughs> and get breakfast. I'm going to use one of these little guys. Let's do, I have a blue one there. So let's do green. I have a sheet of egg stickers and I've, oh, maybe green's not the best. Anyways, I really want to use my egg stickers. <laughs> Here, we'll use this pink one. For um, breakfast because I love breakfast we went to Burger King we just got we just grabbed sandwiches and I love their iced coffee so nothing fancy so oh I have to put laundry and I'm gonna have to move this sticker hopefully it comes up Yes. There we go. Let's just do it here. There. Um, oh, I forgot yesterday we also got takeout for lunch, but that's okay. Y'all don't need to know how crappy I ate yesterday, especially after losing two pounds. Um, so not only did we do Burger King and got groceries, <laughs> um, I also had to had groceries delivered. So we had both. Um, I don't think I need to mark all of that. That's okay. Um, oh, I am filming a YouTube video, you guys. Oh, wow. And I have these, so I have these Coffee Monsters Co. I think I got them in a D stash. I don't know where they came from because they're cut up. They're not whole sheets. I have these and then I have this one. I think this is Coffee Monsters. And then I have these YouTube buttons. I don't know where they came from. I think they were in a D stash. Maybe someone cut the sheets up and I got them. But they are, they're off center so they're not cut like really good 
which I'm okay with. I don't, I'm not complaining, but I don't know where they came from. I don't think I've ever cut up any sh like orders that I've had, but these are like old Coffee Monsters Co. So film, that's what I'm doing right now. I may end up using the upload sticker. Um, who knows what's going to happen the rest of the day. I do have to make supper tonight, so I could do that. I have a cooking sticker. Um, we have Loretta cooking. Let's see. Plants. Here we go. And I do have to do some chopping. So I'm going to use this one. She's chopping veggies and stuff on a cutting board. And I'm going to pair it with a box. I'm making this Italian dish. Um, let's see. I'm going to do a big box. Right there. So, what I have left, again, I don't have much deco, which is okay. It, it's fine. I do want to use the sticker with this cute flower, though. Um, these are like Christmas bulbs. These are just boxes. I don't really use these trackers. I should with my working out, but I have the tracker up front of my planner. And I could have used more of these stickers, but that's okay. We do what we do. We just wing it. So I have a flower here. Let's put one over here. Like maybe here in the middle. And then I have my Coffee Monsters Co. Um, book, but I'm pretty sure I have, let's see, I can do a weekend sticker for this spread. Um, I think the pink one, that'll add some deco. Yeah, that's cute. These are what I was thinking of. These are the stickers that you pay it forward. Um, I like this little flower. I actually bought some for myself and then I also paid some forward. <laughs> but I like that. Let's see. Yeah, let's do that one. Cute little pink flower. Um, oh, and I have this anniversary one. Let's see. I'll actually kind of do these together as a deco. So this was a sheet on like the super soft paper. Um, and the colors in this sheet go really well with this kit. So... I'm going to stick the coffee emoji on Monday. Um, it just makes sense. I did a lot of working later in the week with the new releases and contact cards. So I'm going to put this working emoji here. Um, I don't need the sleeping one because I already have the sleeping washi up top. So... Um... This is hard. I'm going to put the book sticker here as some deco because I'm sure I was really into my audiobook. I should actually, I only got one of these sheets. I should order 
some more because I really do love this shoe to stickers. So I'm just gonna stick that back in my book. And um, I'm also going to, I'm gonna fill out my sidebar, you guys, but I'm gonna fast forward it, so I'll be right back. Okay, this is as far as I can fill this out for now because I do not remember what we ate earlier in the week. So this is my plan with me for this week. I hope you guys um, enjoyed it. I actually love how this spread turned out. It's so cute. Um, so yeah. Thank you guys for joining me. If you liked this, please subscribe and I hope to see you guys next time. Bye.